What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we have another Pokemon video. Uh, we've been pulling for that shiny Charizard for a while, but let's switch gears for one video and look for the OG version of that card. We have an Elite Trainer box of Burning Shadows pack, so we're going to be looking for the original Rainbow Charizard. But we also have a very exciting mail day. We got some mail from our good friend Eric or EMC. Uh, he sent us something over the holidays, so thank you so much to you. And lastly, we have a piece of fan art from Silverhawk on Discord. And I was kind of show it over here or something. And look at that. Let me just pull it up so I can talk about it. <laughs> It has a Squirtle uh, with these awesome sunglasses, and uh, I agree with the messaging too with that the sign that he's holding. So thank you so much, Silverhawk. I love it. And uh, all right, we got some mail. We got some Burning Shadows packs. Let's begin. All right, so I think what we're going to do is crack open into this box, and then halfway through, we will go through the mail. We only have, I believe, these... The non-special sets they only come with eight packs, which I was never a big fan of. I'm not sure why they have to do it. Well, I guess there's no booster boxes, which is maybe why, but... So non-special set ETBs, not the biggest fan of, but... Uh, and this is a pretty old one at this point. How insane would it be if we could pull a rainbow Charizard, not the shiny, um, in just eight packs of... Ooh. Man, so like, you know, they don't get a lot of things right, Pokemon Company, as far as packaging goes, but they really improved the ETBs. Like, if something was not damaged, but had like a little nick on it from an ETB, that would by no means be surprising. But we got our energies, that stuff. Dice is always cool. Code card, no idea what comes in here. Maybe a Necrozma or something. And yeah, everything is just all over the place. Sleeves, cool. Some, yeah, this was really useful. Good job. All right, we got eight packs. Let us begin. But that would be incredible if we did pull the Charizard. Let's get into our first pack. It's been a while since we opened these. Beyond Charizard, what else are we looking for? Guz this is not set with Guzzlord. Ooh, see something from the side. How insane would it be? The way that that pattern looked, it kind of looked like it might be a supporter. But we have a Rotom deck. Let me switch sides. Potown. Haven't seen these cards in quite some time. Cutie Fly. Riolu. Rhyhorn. Tangela. Dewpider. A Slow King is our. First reverse. Ooh, Gardevoir. Big fan of Gardevoir. When I first, a little off center, when I first got back into Pokemon, I was really excited because Gardevoir was a very relevant card. I believe it was in, featured in one of the championship decks. And I bought it. <laughs> I think that was that. And then another one was like Alola Nightclub or something like that. Okay, so pack one already have a hit. And these aren't Hidden Fates packs, so getting getting a single hit from an ETB like, is kind of par for the course. You know, zero hit boxes were not that uncommon. Plumeri, oh, Kiawe, I think, is in the set. Very unlikely he will get reprinted, but amazing card. Oh, Guzma's also in here. Full Art Guzma would be amazing. Lucario with Stance. Submarine Blow 120 for three fighting energy. We picked up a new PSA card to add to our collection, and it is a Charizard. And here we go. It is Boom! Man, the power creep has been strong over the last couple years. How much the meta has changed as far as how much damage you need to you can deal or need to deal to be viable in today's game. As always, if you guys do enjoy this content, do me a favor, hit that like button. Alright, Tormenting Spray. Whirlipede. Ooh, there he is, Guzma. Such an insane card. Lediba. Cutie Fly. Horsey. Turtonator. Ah, still looking for the shiny GX version of you. Oh my. It's like taunting us. It's 
like, oh, look at all these Turtonators that you can't pull in the Hidden Fate set. Alright, last pack, and then we're going to get into this, this mail from EMC. Once again, thank you so much. You've been a big supporter of the channel, and I really appreciate that. Oh my, we cannot open this pack for anything. Alright, there we go. Alright, show me a Charizard of the rainbow variety. I feel like all new Charizard cards, they just, you know, they start off high and then they pewter out. You know, they just can't repeat the the performance of the Burning Shadows one. Esper, Pansage, Meryl, Oddish, and then an Electros. All right, four packs in. Let's get into this mail. As always, if you do want to send something to the channel, that's always appreciated. And there is an appeal box address down below. All right, so let's see. You don't want to, obviously, you don't want to damage anything. All right, anything else in there? That is it. All right. Dear Wanna Turtle, congrats on hitting 800 subs. As of right you're getting closer to 900. Thank you so much. Um, you will hit 1,000 in no time. That would be insane. And then, then who knows where you'll go. Hopefully you don't get so big where you will forget about all those little guys. I doubt that will happen. Um, I don't see you doing that. Oh, yep, we agree. Uh, as you're a pretty genuine person, thank you. It has been awesome watching your channel grow and the content you have covered is always good. Thank you for helping me in the learning process of playing the TCG. I am really having fun online, hoping to transition to play IRL one day. Keep up the good work. Hope these cards, well, at least two of these will help you get closer to the master sets. Oh boy. I trade a lot of mine to get some codes. Not sure if the best trade along in the long run since I do spend a bit of money on the cards. But it'll be okay. Although if although if you're ever trading or giving away Shiny Ray Ray, my favorite Pokemon, you know where to reach me. Uh, hope this hope you enjoy these cards. Look forward to next PTCGO match and stream. Merry Christmas to you and your family. Kindly EMC Squared. Thank you so much. Hope you had a good holiday. And uh, actually, EMC posted a very cute picture <laughs> on the Discord not too long ago. All right, let's see what we got. Hidden Fate sleeves. It's always a good start, right? Let's see. All right, we got three cards for the first one. Oh, Shrine of Punishment. Oh my gosh. You are way too generous. This is actually one that we still needed. And the worst part is we pulled one of these and I was really happy about it. And then I traded it and like, it must have been for something good because I did, I did place a lot of value in that card. But I cannot remember what I traded it for. So Shrine of Punishment. Thank you so much. Alright, then we have one in a sleeve and one in knots. Let's do this one first. Then we have oh, another one that we need. So we've been like, you sent me this. Uh, and then I went away for the holidays. And we've been checking off a good amount of uh, boxes as far as picking up cards but then the two that you sent actually were not ones that we managed to get yet so thank you so much I think uh, as a filming this like we need 11 cards and now we're down to nine thank you so much and our last one oh, actually I think uh, you sent us like a shadow Lugia next time this one is a shadow armored Mewtwo these uh these cards are pretty well well made a little bit nick in the corner but um wow that's really cool Thank you so much, and uh, I can't believe it. We are two steps closer to that master set. Thank you so much, uh, EMC. All right, let's finish these. this ETB. We got four more packs, four more shots at that OG Charizard. Not the OG Charizard, OG Rainbow Charizard. And other cards have tried to do a repeat of what this, this one has accomplished. The Reshizard, which at one point... And we actually bought a, we actually bought at least one. Uh, the Reshizard was going around two hundred dollars, and right now it's like a third of that. Olivia, nice, that's a pretty good card. Dupider, Tangela, Hootoot, Sandy Gas, Rhydon, and then a Heracross. So we got our our ultra rare right off the bat. Oh man, it's so nice to see those in the background. Once again, thank you so much. Oh, I feel like 
No, we have some of the best subs. Uh, shout outs to you, Silver. Again, that art was amazing. Um, since you sent me a uh, pretty good copy of it, like, I wonder if I could turn that into... Nah, it'd probably be difficult to turn that into, like, an emote or something. But, alright, three packs remaining. Dewpider, Noibat, Pikachu, Esper, Pansage, Rabambi, and then a Zygarde. Four energy, 150. Again, the power creep has been ridiculous as of the last couple years. So we did manage to pull a Charizard out of from Burning Shadows on the channel. It'd be amazing to get number two. And as far as like Charizards, we're doing pretty good. I believe we pulled one Reshizard, one Burning Shadows Charizard, and two Hidden Fates ones. Ooh, Reverse Guzma, that's a pretty good card. And then a Crabominable. All right, last pack. Can we get some last pack magic? As, oh, oh my gosh, why, why do I keep doing that? As always, thank you all for watching. Appreciate all the support on the channel. And uh, yeah, actually, kind of like what that what that mail said. You know, we're getting close to getting pretty close to 900 mark. That is ridiculous. And uh, yeah, from there, we're just gonna keep pushing on onto 1,000. What a amazing day that will be when we hit that. If we hit that. So thank you everyone for all the support. Thank you EMC. Thank you another Guzma. Nice. Thank you, Silver. And here we go with our last pack. So thanks again for watching, everyone. I'm Wanda Turtle. Ah, Butterfree, this card's terrible. And I'll catch you guys next time.